Hey guys, Jason here at Normal Soul Sportswear. Um, this weekend, you're going to find us vending at the uh, North of England uh, Flags Finals weekend, hosted by Rochdale Lacrosse Club. If you're not familiar with what Flags Finals is, um, it's all the North of England finals, all uh, played over the same weekend, Saturday and Sunday. There'll be some fantastic games. Um, I'm playing in one of the finals on the Saturday. And um, on the Sunday, you can see the Senior Flags Finals, which is going to be a fantastic game. Um, Brooklands versus Cheadle. Um, one thing I want to tell you about flags, um, which this year doesn't seem to be particularly well advertised, in, in all fairness. Um, so I hope you watch this video and I hope you start sharing it and remind everyone that it's Flags Finals weekend. Um, but the Senior Flags is actually the oldest lacrosse competition that is contested and um, it actually goes back to I'm just going to check the date the 1883-1884 season so it's a really really old trophy and if um, I say trophy it's not a trophy it's actual flags now if you're not sure um, the relevance of the flags um, I'm going to show you so the reason it's the flag's final, that's if iPad wants to open, here we go. There's a great image here. And you'll see there that way, way back, the goalposts here actually have flags on the top. Now you'll notice as well, so you know, these flags, this, this, this is what we're playing for, it's the flags. There's no crossbar on the goal. Now, I've, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure I've heard this somewhere and read this somewhere. Cannot find where I found this information from, unfortunately. But the crossbar that we now know on a goal was actually invented here in the UK. So it was actually introduced um, by lacrosse players here in, the, in England that we actually put a crossbar on these goals. And we no longer had flags on the top of the goals and had a crossbar instead. Now, I'm not sure whether with the introduction of the crossbar also came the introduction of a net, because you'll notice there's no net. There's no net here, is there? You'll score between these two posts or between the two flags. So if there's anybody out there that actually knows at what point we introduced a crossbar. At what point we introduced a net. And you can't see in this one, because I'm not sure at that time there was anything around the goal. But, um, you know, the crease, you know, the goal circle, that crease. Did you know the crease used to be square? That's right, it was a square crease. So, um, anyway, it's Flags Finals weekend. So make sure you make your, your, your way to Rochdale. Come and support lacrosse. The weather looks like it's going to be pretty good this weekend. Um, that Europe's biggest lacrosse vendor will be vending there. Uh, so you can come and see us and buy some stuff. Um, there will also be a couple of other lacrosse resellers there. Um, you'll, you'll notice who they are. They're the ones with nobody in their tent. We'll be swamped under customers. Um, so come say hi. Um, come and check some lacrosse out. Um, come and support the game. And let's make a real event of Flags Finals at Rochdale this weekend. See you there.